Hello and welcome back to my channel. I thank you all that have liked and subscribed and have got us over 3K subs, you guys. I appreciate you guys. You guys are amazing. And for those that are watching me now, I am mommy to eight, seven kids still at home, you guys. So today I want to jump right in it. Let's talk about how I manage this home with all these kids. Let's do this. You guys, chores. So how do I do chores with these kids? So my kids have a chore list that they go by. Now, I really focus a lot on the upstairs. So let's say one kid has to do the floors upstairs. One kid is doing the laundry room. Another kid is doing one in the restrooms. Our boys are doing some of the toilets because if you have boys, you know, they be like to pee everywhere. So for me, with chores, I have to do a chore list to break up these kids to have things done. And you guys, it works for us. So hey, say hi to my fur baby, London. Come over here, London. Come here, fur babies. Come here, fur babies. So it works for us. So having a large family, we definitely have to break up things to get things done. As far as the kitchen goes, I try to do a chore list on the kitchen. And then I also try to have the kids wash up their own dishes that they use, but that did not work. Somebody was always sneaking something in and running away. So for the kitchen, it is a team effort. We all get together, excuse me, and we do the dishes, we mop, we sweep, we all do it. I get in there and I help too. I'm a huge person on help because that is how my, excuse that cargo my, that is how my parents raised us. We are very hardworking people. So I get in the kitchen a lot with the kids um, and we do it all together. So having a large family, chores has to be a list and then sometimes you just gotta do it together. Now. Let's talk about that laundry, y'all. Okay, guys, so I'm going up these stairs here. Now, as far as laundry is going, I don't mind throwing all the kids' clothes in the laundry. I'm out of breath because I worked out. And now I'm doing the stairs. I did legs today, you guys, so bear with me while I walk up these stairs. But I don't mind throwing all the laundry in for the kids. And then when we are done with the laundry, you guys, I like to hang things up. I am not a fan of folding clothes. They can fold up their personal items, their self, but I do do a lot of hanging up stuff. So here in the laundry room, you guys, here I am. Laundry detergent, washer, dryer. Everybody chips in. I throw it in there, they go in there, we get hangers and we hang everything up. We have walk-in closets for the boys, walk-in closet for my closet, and then my daughter's closet, it's just a regular closet, but it works. Laundry is easier done when you have a large family who put everything on hangers. So for, sorry you guys, I'm juggling this camera. So for my large family, you guys, chore is something that we all do together. Laundry is something that we all do together. And I like to hang up their clothes, not fold them. So pants, shirts, everything goes on hangers. If they have pajamas, they can fold them. Um, their personal items, they can fold them and put them on top of their closet in their rooms. And for, sorry. So another question, how uh, do my older kids help out with the younger kids? I am a personal person that believes that it's not the older kids responsibility to take care of the younger kids. Do they help out sometimes? Yes but a lot of that responsibility um, falls back on the parent where it should be. If one kid like wants like a chocolate milk warm up, one of the kids will do that for them, warm up a little something for them, but mama takes care of all that. It works for my family, may not work for others, but that is how I run my house. Um, let's see, I'm gonna take you guys on a food haul next month to show you how we do our Thanksgiving cooking. And then let's get into Thanksgiving, you guys. So for Thanksgiving time, it's really fun around here because on Thanksgiving time, you guys, we all pick a dish that we want to make. I'm making the turkey and the stuffing. My daughter's doing the greens. Another one's doing mac and cheese. My son, I always help him with the candy yam. We get in here and we work as a team on Thanksgiving. It's fun. I like to have fun with the kids and I like them to experience cooking because there's going to be a day when they get out there that they got to cook for themselves. Back downstairs we go, y'all. Let's do this. So running a large family, a lot of people don't understand that. A large family is not like your, if you have one or two kids. 
I have eight kids, seven still at home. My house is going to take a lot more work than somebody that has less kids. So I have to run it on a tighter, tighter shift here. Work with me. So we're heading back downstairs and getting over here into that kitchen area. So let's go. Let's do this, y'all. Let's do this. So as I was saying, my family, we do chores. We break it up. We cook. We all do a special meal on the holidays. My large family, laundry. We all chip in the laundry. It works for us. Teamwork is where it's at. I hope you guys enjoy this short video. I hope you give it a thumbs up and subscribe. I am mommy to eight, seven kids at home. I'll see you guys next time. Thank you.